Domo Amejin des, back with another beginning Japanese lesson. Today, lesson 27, distance and duration. Just to review really quick, um, do you remember the phrase place kara kimashita? Place kara kimashita, meaning I'm from or I come from this place. In this lesson, we're going to kind of break down um, what that really means and get into the grammar of it. And our key sentence today, koko kara gakkou made basu de ichi jikan gurai kakarimasu. Okay, we'll explore that throughout this lesson. Our vocabulary today, quite a lot. It's just this page. Um, the first one is the counter for hours, jikan, jikan. Okay, to take time, the verb meaning to take time is kakaru or kakarimasu. Kakaru, kakarimasu. And then uh, a suffix meaning about or approximately is gudai, kudai, gudai, kudai. Okay, you can pick either one. I tend to use gudai more. That's why I put it first, but either one is fine. How or by what means is uh, when you ask how or by what means, you say doyatte, doyatte, doyatte. By uh, the particle meaning by or via or by whatever means is de, de. By foot or on foot, the set phrase aruite, aruite. And then the word for bus is bus, bus, bus. Bicycle, jitensha, jitensha, train, densha, densha. Okay. The question, how long? How long does something take? How long? Dono gurai, dono kurai. Again, either one is fine. And then the word for uh, from, which you already learned, which is why I bolded it. Uh, kara, kara, from, kara. And then up to, made, made, up to. Let's um, focus on the hours real quick, how to make hours in Japanese. If you want to say one hours, two hours, three hours, three and a half hours, that would be ichi jikan. Nijikan, Sanjikan, Sanjikan Hang. All right, to uh, three and a half hours. The Hang, remember, is a 30 minute time interval, half an hour. Let's get into our grammar to and from. So we can use Kara and Made to indicate uh, from some place or time to another place or a time. A Kara from A. A Made up to A. All right. For example, koko kara soko made. From here to there. All right, and notice those are places. Koko soko. Uh, this is uh, time. Yoji kara goji made. From four o'clock to five o'clock. Okay. Activity one: fill in each blank based on the illustration below. Pause the video. Try it on your own right now. I'm gonna solve it right now. Number one: Jessica wa. Nani nani kara nani nani made ikimashita. Remember, ikimashita is the past tense form of ikimas to go. Uh, so we're saying that Jessica went from this place to this place. So let's find Jessica. Here she is in yellow. Jessica, Jessica. Wa e doko kara where from where? Suba 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 kara doko made. Toshokan made, toshokan made to the library. Ikimashita. Went. Jessica went from the supermarket to the library. Simple as that. Number two, Tony. Tony wa, where's Tony? Here's Tony in green. Tony wa, doko kara, doko made ikimashita. From where to where did he go? Well, according to this, he went from the ginko, the bank, to the kouen. Kouen, the park. Okay, so we're gonna say Tony wa ginko kara kouen made ikimashita. He went from the bank to the car, uh, park. Number three, Mark. Mark wa. Here's Mark. He's already in the kouen and he's going to the gym. Mark wa kouen kara gym made ikimashita. And number four, Kashi. Here's Kashi in red. Wa. She went from school 
to uh, a house or her house. And here are the answers in bold. Challenge, rewrite the sentences, these sentences here, the answers, using ni instead of made. I think this is an important time to talk about the difference between ni and made. They're basically the same thing uh, in this case. Remember, you can say Suba ni ikimas. I will go to the supermarket. You could also say Suba made ikimas. I will go to the supermarket. But made has a slightly different feel to it than ni. Made feels like you're just going up to, right, and no nowhere further, just up to the supermarket. Um, really, they're kind of interchangeable in Japanese. So use whatever you like. In this case. They're clearly interchangeable. You can add in ni wherever you see made. Activity two, fill in each blank based on Julie's schedule. Here's Julie, and here's her schedule. We've seen this before, right, in the past. Uh, pause the video, try it on your own right now. I'm going to solve this here. Number one, Nihongo no jugyo wa nani nani kara nani nani made desu. So this is an example of time, specific hours of time, right? You could say, you can use days of the week with made and kara, maybe getsuyoubi kara, suyoubi made. You can do that. In this case, though, um, it's time. So, nihongo no jugyo wa, here's the nihongo no jugyo in blue, wa nani nani kara nani nani made desu. We're, we're saying that her Japanese class is from this time up to that time up to, right? So from 9 to 11. 9 to 11 in the morning. So we would say, Nihongo no jugyo wa kuji kara juichiji made desu. Kuji kara juichiji made desu. Right? Number two, kayoubi to mokuyoubi wa nani nani kara nani nani made bungaku no jugyo desu. Bungaku no jugyo. Literature class. Here's bungaku. No jugyo in red on kayobi and mokuyobi, mokuyobi uh, Tuesday and Thursday, and the times for this are 3 p.m. to 4:30, 3 p.m. to 4:30 p.m. So we would say in Japanese, sanji kara yoji han made bungaku no jugyo desu. Mm -hmm. As for Tuesday and Thursday, uh, from 3 to 4.30 is literature class. 3. Getsu ka sui mokuyoubi wa juichi ji un ichi ji un jugyo ga arimasen. Arimasen. Remember, arimas means to have something. Ga arimas, I have this. Uh, arimasen is the negative. Conjugation. You don't have something. So, getsu ka sui moku youbi wa. As for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, from I guess 11. Yeah, from 11, right? 2, 1. There are no classes. She has no classes. So, we would say, juichi ji kara ichi, ma, gogo ichi ji made jugyo ga arimasen. All right, and for kinyobi shinigaku no jugyo wa nani nani kara nani nani made desu. Shinigaku is psychology, this uh, pink box right here, and the times are 1 30 p.m. to 4 30 p.m. So we would say, gogo ichi ji han kara gogo yoji han made desu. Here are the answers in bold. Okay, um, let's indicate now how to say how we traveled somewhere. Okay, by bus, on foot, by car, whatever. We can use that using the particle de. For example, Kyoto kara densha de Tokyo ni ikimashita. I went from Kyoto to Tokyo by train. Densha de by train. Bus de kaerimashita. I went home by bus. De is like by something via something by means of this vehicle or whatever. 
Okay, now you might be tempted to ask how or by what means using <laughs> the question word nani and de. Nan de or nani de ikimashita ka? Um, I'm going to tell you right now, Japanese people don't really say this <laughs> in real life. You would think, yes, it should be question word and then de, but it's not. Instead, they use the set phrase, do yatte, do yatte. Do ikimashita ka? Okay, so use that instead. And another warning, um, on foot, to say on foot or by foot, there is a set phrase, aruite, aruite. You just have to memorize that, okay? Aruite, suba made ikimashita. I went to the supermarket on foot. Activity three, make a sentence for each person in the table below. Go ahead, pause the video, try it on your own. I'm going to make sentences now. <laughs> the sentences I may make now uh, will probably differ from the answer slide that I show on the next page, but um, I'll try to get them as close as I can. Well, let's start with, we have four people. Let's start with Rita. Rita. Rita wa. And the very the most basic sentence we could say is Toshokan kara jimu made aruite ikimashita. Rita went from the library to the gym on foot. Ikimashita, right? Went. Past tense. You could honestly move these around in your sentence because Japanese is flexible and you can do that. Rita wa uh, let's start with aruite. Rita wa aruite toshokan kara jimu made ikimashita. So Rita on foot went from the library to the gym. We could even separate kara and made and put aruite in the middle. <laughs> Rita wa toshokan kara aruite jimu made ikimashita. That's fine as well. Let's move on. Marco, Marco wa cafe uh, kara ie made uh, de. Let's say ikimas for a change, right? We're using past tense a lot. Let's use the present slash future tense of Japanese. Ikimas, which means he will go or he goes normally. He goes. Mark, Marco, I guess, Marco goes from the cafe to his home or to a house by bicycle. Jitensha, remember, jitensha is bicycle. Serina. Serina wa byouin kara tsuba made kuruma de. Let's say kimashita. Come or came, right? Came. Kimashita. Serina wa byouin kara tsuba made kuruma de kimashita. She came from the hospital to the supermarket by car. Masuo wa makudonaldo kara gakko made. Densha de kimas. So Masuo comes to school from McDonald's by train. All right. Did I get all that from ah? Mm, 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 mm. Almost the same. For these last two examples, notice I replaced made made with ni, which you can do in this case. Okay. Um. Actually, yeah. I think ni sounds better with kimas. Yeah, I don't know why. Made, made, kimas. I I guess it's fine, but mm, maybe ni with kuru kimas is better. Anyways, challenge question. Answer the question. Do yatte ikimashita ka? For each person, pretend like I'm asking you for Rita. Uh, Rita wa do yatte jimu made ikimashita ka? How did she go to the gym? And then you just give a quick answer, right? Let's try that. Oh, you can try that on your own. All right, moving on with our grammar, indicating duration. This is the second half of the lesson. It's getting long. To indicate how long a trip took, you can use the verb kakarimasu. Kakarimasu, okay? A kakarimasu. It takes a amount of time. A is some kind of interval of time. Koko kara nijikan kakarimasu. Koko kara nijikan kakarimasu. From here, it takes two hours. Okay. Uh, walking, it takes 10 minutes. Okay. And then the words kudai and gudai uh, are used after a amount of time to indicate approximately or about. You can ask how long using dono kudai and dono gudai. All right. 
very simple, straightforward. Nijikan gurai kakarimasu. It takes about two hours. Dono kurai kakarimasu ka? How, about how long does it take? Okay. Nanjikan kakarimasu ka? <laughs> how many hours does it take? Simple as that. Um, be careful. Try not to use uh, kurai and kurai with specific, very specific times. So like, 1時間 24分 kurai kakarimasu. <laughs> you might want to round that up to 1時間 半 kurai. Okay, that might be better. Sound more natural. Activity 4. The table below shows the duration from Caleb's house to each given destination, along with the time it takes uh, based on the means of transportation given. Make one statement in Japanese for each destination. Pause the video, try it on your own. I'm going to do this right now. Number one, we'll s our first destination is the gym. Okay, Caleb goes to the gym. Jimu made aruite jugo fun kakarimasu. Jimu made aruite jugo fun kakarimasu. Okay, it takes uh, 15 minutes walking uh, on foot to go to the gym. Okay. Ginko, ginko made. Let's do. Jitensha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not jitensha. Densha de. We can, we can round this, I guess. Jugo fun gurai kakarimasu. Ginko made jiten, ah, yeah, densha de jugo fun gurai kakarimasu. Or you could round up if you want. I think jugo fun is closer. Ni, ni fun gurai kakarimasu, you can say. Eh, tonari no machi. Remember, tonari is neighboring, right? So the neighboring town, the next town over. Tonari no machi made. Aruite <laughs> for fun. Aruite, nijikan kakarimasu. It takes two hours on foot to go to the next town. And then finally, eigakan, eigakan made, bus de, nifun gurai kakarimasu. Takes about two minutes, we could say. Nifun kakarimasu. Takes two minutes, about two minutes. Here are some sample answers that I wrote beforehand. Mm -mm. We're winding down our lesson to the listening practice. I'm going to read two compositions twice in Japanese. Listen and write down what you hear, okay? Pause the video if you need more time. Number one. Koko kara eki made dono gurai kakarimasu ka? Koko kara eki made dono gurai kakarimasu ka? Pause the video if you need more time. I'm going to show the answer right now. Koko kara eki made dono gurai kakarimasu ka? About how long does it take to go from here to the station? Number two. Gakko made jitensha de ikimasu. Gakko made jitensha de ikimasu. And the answer for that is. That. I go to school, up to school, by bike. And now, activity six, translation practice. Translate the following statements into either English or Japanese. Pause the video, take your time. I'm going to reveal the answers right now. First guy says, Mayasa, Gakko made aruite ikimasu. Remember, Mayasa means every morning. Uh, up to school, I go by walking, or in more natural English, every morning I go to school on foot. The bottom girl says, Japanese class is from 10 in the morning until 12 o'clock. In Japanese, this would be, Nihongo no jugyo wa asa juji kara juniji made desu. You could also say, uh, gozen instead of asa. All right. Back to our key sentence. Koko kara gakko made basu de ichijikan gurai kakarimasu. You should now know that this means from here up to school by bus, it takes about one hour. Okay. And our shukudai, our homework. How long to Tokyo? Answer the question. Soko kara e, Tokyo made dono gurai kakarimasu ka? Dono kurai kakarimasu ka? To state how long it takes by plane, hikouki de, 
to get from your location to Tokyo. Use Google Maps or something, maybe a travel website to, I don't know, find a plane from your nearest airport to Tokyo and then just state how long it takes in Japanese. Also, how do you go to school? <laughs> Answer the question, どうやって学校に行きますかどうやって学校に行きますか To state how you go to school, okay? If you don't go to school, state how you go to work. And if you don't work or go to school, pretend you work or go to school, pick any random location, and then just give a fake answer. <laughs> as long as you're using Japanese, that's the point. And as always, there's a worksheet that goes with every lesson, including this lesson. You can find it at my website, link in the description below. That's it, guys.、Um, it was a long lesson. I tried to go as fast as I could. I hope you all learned a lot. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them in the comments section below. Otherwise, I hope to see you guys in a future lecture.